Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we are going to be on continuing our adventure into Dark Forces. But before we continue, I wanted to give a brief overview of the mod that's being used for this Let's Play. It's called the Force Engine, as you can see on our screen. And basically this, mo this mod uh, makes the game more stable and runs very well. Um, uh, very impressed with this mod. Uh, you can find the details, the links to the, uh, to the mod uh, below on the description. So uh, let's, let's look here. Um, so these are just your options. Uh, it's a pretty cool looking screen. Uh, we got the manual here, which that's the uh, manual for the mod. Uh, pretty self-explanatory. Credits, settings. This is, this is actually um, pretty cool. Uh, this is basically what replaces the uh, settings for Dark Forces. You've got game settings about uh, descriptions, inputs. Yeah, it, it basically it's a, it, it's everything's set to the mouse now, so you don't have to worry about you know setting it you know doing anything complicated to get the mouse to work. Uh, graphics, self you know you can set your Window, you can have window mode, color correction, um, you can set your resolution, your HUD. They're still working on the HUD. I'm not going to, I'm, I'm not going to click sound because they haven't, uh, they haven't quite finished that yet. The, so there's, there's just some minor things they, they still have to work on, but overall the game runs fantastic. So let's uh, let's continue the let's play. Uh, we're going to be doing the second level. Beautiful. Very beautiful. We will skip the intro. Uh, it's pretty long. But let's uh, let's do begin mission. Kyle delivers the plans to the Rebel Alliance. Soon afterwards, the Death Star is destroyed. But even as the Alliance celebrates this victory, another sinister plot is set in motion that will become an even greater concern for the Rebellion. So as you can see, the cinematics work great. Right. The Emperor has approved your test demonstration, General Mock. Thank you, Lord Vader. What I unveil today will mark a new era for the Empire. We will be able to decimate the Rebels just as we did the Jedi Knights. At last, the Emperor's war will be filled only with the glory and beauty of decisive victory. A noble cause, General. I hope the demonstration lives up to your claims. Proceed. With pleasure. Dark Trooper, release. And they're releasing the Dark Troopers. The most underrated uh, character in the franchise, I think. Okay, so they're landing on the planet and they're gonna do a lot of destruction. Very impressive, General. The Emperor will be most pleased. Continue with your project. Certainly, Lord Vader. Thank you, Commander, for responding at such short notice. The Empire has been keeping us on the run since the destruction of the Death Star. Five days ago, the Empire attacked one of our secret bases in the city of Talay. 
This is tech based to anybody out there. Please, we're under imperial attack. There was no warning at all. Total devastation. They broke through our shields. They broke through our shields. Attack base was destroyed within minutes. Many innocent people in the surrounding city, as well as the rebel staff, were killed. Intelligence thinks that this may be an act of retaliation for the destruction of the Death Star. Interesting. This looks like it could be a normal Imperial attack, except for those sounds. Very perceptive, Commander. I know you understand that all we discuss here is classified. This Imperial officer, Crix Medin, wishes to defect to the Alliance. He has supplied us with information on the development of a new Imperial weapon. Those sounds you heard, we believe, come from that weapon. A new type of stormtrooper, the Dark Trooper. A new stormtrooper that can take out a rebel base that quickly? I should have kept working for the Empire. <laughs> the Rebel Command is not taking this lightly. They have authorized me to hire you to find out if there is a threat, and if there is, to shut it down. That is, if you are still on our side. This could be interesting. All right, I'm in. But I think I'll need some help in this one. I want Jan Ors as my mission officer. Certainly. Then I will let Jan brief you further on your mission objectives. Thank you, Commander, and may the Force be with you. Alright. So, uh, yeah. Kyle Katarn was actually a, uh, in the, work for the Empire before this, uh, happened. And so he's having to, um, decide if he still wants to work for the Empire or work for the Rebellion. Whoever, he's right now kind of like a mercenary, so I guess the Rebellion's play, paying him pretty well. So, okay. Anyways, so this is t the Teletalk base mission. We're basically going to go in and uh, search for something in the area. We're going to investigate what's going on on this planet, what happened. Because the Empire just sent something. I'm not going to say it's the Dark Trooper, but it could be. Alright, here we go. Let's take a look at the game. Oh, look at the ship. Looks good. These are high... Re so i got it set to my max resolution. Look at this. If you compare it with the uh, old version, I mean, this is spectacular. No issues at all. So you can see the you can see the, uh, I guess, the Stormtrooper there. I mean, it's not going to be, like, you know, next-gen graphics. It's going to be Dark Forces. But it's going to run everything. The mod's going to run everything pretty smooth. Stop, Rebel! Stop! We gotta carve through a bunch of stormtroopers. And not get shot. can get kind of tricky because like, you can't see it.
we gotta turn the electricity on because everything's dark and none of the doors are And I'll try to get all the secrets. Um, I'm not as versed on the secrets in this game as uh, Dark Forces 2. But there is one here. Generator. the dead body, one of the dead bodies that uh, those dark troopers yeah, they incinerated whoever was here. <laughs> Turns the bridge around. dead bodies. That's just creepy. Uh, when you take them out from out here, it's much easier when you go in. There's a lot of guys, there's a lot of uh, stormtroopers coming up. Secrets in this game are very hard to find, I'll tell you that. Ok, 
Okay. Let's head back. Uh, and up, they, uh, some of the stormtroopers actually do respawn. I don't know if that was intentional or not, but, uh, yeah, there'll be a few guys in our way. That's it for this level. Um, we will see you next time. Uh, next level will be Un Anoa City, my least favorite level in this whole game. In fact, this is my the next level I hate so much. Uh, you'll see why.